I've been through this before. I saw a friend of mine give childbirth right in front of me by accident. It was not a good, it was not fun. It was the most traumatizing shit I ever seen. I'll let you know after this, the video. God damn. But anyway, today's video I'm gonna be reacting to is by BuzzFeed Yellow. By the way, how many goddamn channels has BuzzFeed had? Because I recently saw that Pyrocynical video and he even said like, God damn, how many channels do you have? No, really, how many channels do they have? I never even noticed. I, I, I know there was yellow and blue and red, but then there's a whole bunch of other shit. Anyways, men watch childbirth for the first time. Let's full screen this, and let's do this shit. Yeah, no, it's traumatizing. I have never seen a baby being born before, have you? If it's not your own girl, it's traumatizing. Because you don't want to see your friends. He gets to have a pillow. Nether regions? Okay, she is very pregnant. Did you see like her body react to those gloved hands? Well, she doesn't want that. Somebody's up, up in there. Ah, it takes a lot of people. Oh! Yeah, oh, there was a lot of people. <laughs> oh my. Uh, I don't know if they're gonna ever get to the baby. Oh, oh. She oh, open. wow, she's really, uh... Oh. Here we go! Oh, that's Here it. Here we go! Woo! Oh, All right! right. I, oh, oh! The guy's oh, easy? God. Really? Oh, no. Oh. oh, no, it just shoots right out of there. Oh, yeah, no. yeah. oh God. Oh, complications. <laughs> Why is it all red? It came out of her okay. body, dude. What? Why do you think it's oh, red? Oh, 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 it moves. I, it's not it's a baby, of course it moves. Oh, oh. I feel like I'm watching Alien. They're cutting the umbilical cord, and now another doctor's looking at what I assume is the placenta. Oh. Oh. Oh, don't leave this part. He's like putting a cotton swab on that. That's not gonna help. Oh, give her a series of cotton swab. Fuck, fuck, I didn't see that. Baby from uh, Dawn of the Dead. It's like I'm trying to feel scared, frightened, amazed, and then all at once, and just like my brain cannot take an emotion. I'm just like, <laughs> you're just shocked. This dude, this dude. Oh, I'm still hungry, but even after watching that, you're still the hungry. Majesty of life. We just witnessed a baby being born. It was like mostly gross, but also kind of beautiful. It was really nice. We did it, man. We had a baby. Yeah. God damn. All right, so here's my story. Uh, I'd, probably, I'd probably do it. Probably suck it up. See a little fucker coming out. <laughs> Like he said, if it was my own son or daughter, I would have to do it just to please the wife or the girlfriend. Because, yeah, you don't want the girlfriend to be pissed off at you for, like, not being there if you don't have a good excuse. It's like, you don't want to be there because it's disgusting? Fuck you, then! But anyways, here's my story. Ugh. So, my friend and her husband, they're Filipino, and there's a reason for the story, because every time I see them, they're pregnant. She's pregnant, not they are. I guess it's a Filipino thing, because not once do I ever see my friend not pregnant. Because, okay, here's the thing. I work with her, she's pregnant. She gives birth. I don't see her for a couple of months, and then she's pregnant again. From what I know, she has 10 kids. Yeah. She's a good person though, but goddamn, she has a lot of kids. So yeah. She tells me the day of her uh, birth. And I go like, yeah, I'll be there because we're best friends and all me and her husband too. We're like, we're tight like this shit. I just realized I did this. <laughs> uh, so I, the day of the birth, I go to the hospital with another friend. She's already there. I buy some plushy toys at the gift shop for the baby to be yet to be born. Everything's going fine and shit. The doctors are outside doing their thing. They're saying like, okay, in probably like three or four hours, they're gonna give birth or something. And I have nothing else to do, so I'm there the entire day. All of a sudden, she goes like, I need to throw up. I go, okay. Uh, so yeah, I go uh, outside to find a nurse while me and my friend go out there. 
We're asking the nurse, like, hey, she needs to puke. She needs something. She goes, oh, okay, hold on. She goes, gets a bucket or something. Those things that you put your puke in. We go back in. We let the nurses do her thing. All of a sudden, during the middle of it, the nurses called the fucking doctors, and a whole bunch of fucking doctors run in. Apparently, she's giving birth early. And they're all blocking the fucking door because it's all the doctors came in all of a sudden. I'm trying to get the fuck out because me and my friend are trying to get the fuck out because she's having a birth. She's get, having her child right there and then. I don't want to see this shit. Give her a moment. Give her a privacy. <laughs> but no, the doctors are blocking. Nurses are running in and out. We're like, there's no way we can come out. We get out of this place. So me and my friend are, she's sitting at the chair. I'm behind the chair. Looking like this, trying not to look, but it's so goddamn awkward. <laughs> but yeah, what we thought was puke was her actually giving birth because she was sick. And there was blood everywhere. Oh, for fuck's sakes, I'll never forget that day. Ah, seeing her nether regions, goddamn. Goddamn. Like I said, you don't want to see your best friend's nether regions, especially bloody. But it all went good for her. It went fine. She wasn't screaming. She was just out of it. Guess she was t took a lot of drugs beforehand. Uh. Yeah, and finally the baby got born, and the doctor was like holding the baby and saying like, "So which one of you guys is the father?" And I'm looking at the husband, like, "He is. He is not mine." Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck sakes. But that was pretty traumatized. I still never forget that day. Still never will. Like I said, it's one of those things that will forever be implanted in my head. It will never leave. It will never leave. Anyways, take it easy, Humanoid Nation. Humanoid freak out. Bye. Oh, for fuck's sake. Los chilenos no multiplicamos. Hay un problema, lo solucionamos. Por todo el mundo los chilenos andamos. De bonichoro, ahí no paramos. Tecnología muy avanzada.